Am I the asshole? For pausing my husband's game BC he wouldn't give our baby a bath on time? I paused the internet on every single device in the apartment because my husband refused to get off of the game to give our 8 mo son a bath on time. I know this sounds like you're the asshole but let me explain, there's a lot of background information that went into this decision. My husband does not help with the household whatsoever. Doesn't wash dishes, do laundry, clean any room of the house, cook dinner, etc. He'll get home and throw off his uniform onto the floor and leave it there until the next day. If the house is dirty, he'll chide me and tell me that I don't do anything, I don't clean enough, I don't cook dinner enough, etc. Our biggest issue is the baby. I am the main caretaker for our son 99.9 .9 of the time. I get up with him during the night when he wakes up crying. My husband will hear or there, but he'll start screaming at me about how he needs his rest and I need to get up. If our son is sick, I'm the one that takes off work. I've missed almost six week of work in the past three months because my husband wouldn't even ask his supervisor if he could stay home one of those days. I'm the one that gets up at 6 a.m. and stays up with our son until about 12 p.m. 1 p.m. and that's when I tell my husband he needs to get up and take care of the baby so I can take a nap he sleeps anywhere from 8 14 hours a day while I take a nap between 1 4 hours. Once I get up, he complains that I've been sleeping all day while he's been taking care of the baby by himself and I'm lazy. Am I the asshole? Update my husband just came into the bedroom and told me he wants a divorce because he's sick of my shit. LOL. Op, the issue is not the game, the issue is that he's abusive. Also I have wanted a divorce time after time, but we are from states at the opposite ends of the country, and I get out of the military next year and he's got four more in. He made it clear that he will not allow me to take my son back to my home state so I can be with family. For those asking why I had a baby with him, trust me. I've asked myself the same thing over and over again. But hindsight is 2020. baby is here and a very lovely boy in the light of my life. It hurts my heart to think his father doesn't see him as a priority, as well as him possibly growing up to treat women the way his father treats me. Trust me I want to leave and have been thinking about it for a while. To those asking the only thing my husband brings to the table is maybe $1,000 a month to help pay for daycare, formula, diapers, groceries, etc. I have never spent one dime of his money on myself. I don't even need the grant, but it helps to live comfortably. As far as everything else goes, I could have let him play his game and take care of the baby myself, but given the history, I wanted him to understand that it's a team effort and I'm to be respected as well, and that he needs to learn to prioritize. Not the asshole. You outrank him after all. He threatened to break your phone? Time to impose an Article 15. Not the asshole. Your husband is abusive towards you and neglectful of your baby. Even if you were a stay-at-home parent, you shouldn't need to take care of most of the child care. However, you both your husband demands you are always the one to get up when the baby needs something in the middle of the night, you are the one who needs to clean, you are the one who needs to take off of work, you are the one whose job is unimportant. You don't need to just pause the game. You need to shut off your marriage. I paused the internet on every single device in the apartment because my husband refused to get off of the game to give our 8 most son a bath on time. I know this sounds like you're the asshole but let me explain. No explanation needed. Your child comes first. He can game after the baby is settled for the night. Not the asshole. Op I was going to suggest you need a divorce but it seems your husband beat me to it. Of course you're not the asshole but what bothers me is your husband is only 23 years young and his mindset is similar to people from the 1980s. Why is he like this? What kind of people is he around? Not the asshole your husband is a loser. That's about all that needs to be said. Your husband is using weaponized incompetence. You are not the asshole. Why are you raising your kid to be around a man like this? You really want your son to grow up and think this is normal? You know if you stay and normalize this behavior your son will become just like his dad? Is that okay with you? Unfortunately common among military men or Sam woman in the military, your husband is abusive and misogynistic. I'd honestly just give him the boot. He contributes nothing but stress and extra work to the relationship. Balancing life and the military is hard enough when you have two babies instead of just the one you agreed to have. Not the asshole no explanation needed, smiley face. Info what is your husband bringing to the table? Obviously not the asshole and also, why are you still married to him? You're already a single mom anyway. Not the asshole. There are several red flags of abuse here. 
if he's not willing to do counseling and make some changes in his behavior both you and your baby would be better off without him. Not the asshole. Mehor sola ke mala companyata. You are better off alone than in bad company. You do it all by yourself now so what is the difference? Oh and guaranteed child support to boot. He is an immature asswipe. Run girl run. Go to another state before he changes his mind. He threatened you with violence. Do you have a family member or friend to stay with? I am very concerned and if he gets this angry he should be left to care for your child. Run not the asshole. Not the asshole you've got two children in the house, and you have all my sympathy. Not the asshole at all not even a little bit why are you still with him when you could do so much better? It seems all he really does is create more work for you. Sometimes it comes down to are you better off with or without him. Your husband is not mature enough to be a partner and father. What you do with that information is up to you. Not the asshole, reevaluate this relationship. That's just downright abusive and honey you need to run um so much into. Not the asshole even without all the explanation. Keeping babies on their schedule is incredibly important. Nta. I am a veteran and so is my ex-husband. He would shed his camis and leave them on the floor as well. I stapled them to the floor one time and it magically fixed the problem. This was after months and months and countless talks and compromises that got me nowhere. Try that lol. I have two kids with my wife and I can't imagine allowing my wife to contribute 99.9 .9 of the caretaking of our children. What the fuck? Leave that man. Not the asshole. Not the asshole but why are you in this relationship? It seems like you would be much better off on your own. Not the asshole but it's a drop in the bucket because he doesn't respect you not your job, not your mothering, not your homemaking, or anything else. He is incredibly selfish and self-centered and frankly childish. He's not a partner in any way. Living without him would be easier than living with him, since not only is he little help, he actively makes your days harder. I'm not saying divorce something has to change so that he starts respecting you and taking on some of the load. He needs to man up. Not the asshole. OP stop fucking around with this leave quietly nonsense. Find a lawyer that handles military divorces and get a consultation to discuss whatever this is you think he is holding over you. Find out what your options are and how to get ahead of this thing. Not the asshole he made that baby too and yet he doesn't want the responsibility. Unfortunately I don't see this getting any better. This is what happens sometimes. Especially at a young age. You have a baby and you think it will be one way but then it's not. It turns out completely different than your fantasy. Being in the military is a hard job, you're away from family, don't have any support but each other. Your husband sounds every immature. Not the asshole but things need to change, your husband is hurting you with his behavior, and as your son gets older he's going to be affected too. Not the asshole. Reach out to your cock and let them know you need help getting by out of a bad marriage. They can help get you resources and support through this. I know it's rough but you are strong and you can definitely get through it, you'll have a much better quality of life for you and your baby when you let go of that toxic dead weight dragging you both down. Run take that baby and run don't look back. Not the asshole your husband is abusive. Leave if you can, file for child support. So sorry you're in this situation. Ask for help from family or friends. Why are you waiting around for him to hit you? He's working his way up to it. Report him and request a transfer. Not the asshole. Hey, do you really want to raise a child with someone who throws a tantrum and is violent when they are pushed to be an active parent? I had a husband like yours. Had. Contact a lawyer and divorce the oversized kid. He better walk the line because Mill don't tolerate crap like his. Absolutely not the asshole. Also, this is the sort of thing you should report to his command unit. The branch I was in, it would be his unit's first sergeant, but whatever the equivalent is in your branch. It might be easiest to go to your own first sergeant or equivalent and they can reach out to his unit's leadership. Op, sounds like you are in the military. What your husband is doing is abuse. He verbally abuses you, next step could be physical. Please seek help. There are resources available, people who will talk it out with you. You aren't alone. Talk to your CO. Tell them you're being threatened. Tell them now. Tell them everything, what he is threatening you with. What is happening? Tell them you are not safe and you are scared for you and your child's life. This is not the first, second, or even millionth time there has been an abuser in the military. You either get ahead of it all now or your husband escalates. Keeping this all hidden gives him power. Take it away. 
Defend yourself. Take care of your son. Not the asshole but go talk to people and get help now. I rarely comment on these, but I wanted to say you seem like an incredibly resilient, amazing woman I have faith you'll get out of this and your life will be so much better for you and your son, heart.